I'm telling you, you have a chance to win some free playoff tickets, compliments of the Dallas Mavericks here at Victory Plaza this morning. All you have to do is show up here right now with your face painted and show off your Mav spirit. You should see some of the kids out here right now. You're going to have some massive competition. Reps from the Mavericks will be here to judge the most creative face painting. The winners will take home tickets to a playoff game. And we have quite an early morning crowd gathered here outside our Victory Park studios with faces painted. They are hoping to win Mavs tickoff, Mavs playoff tickets. Ten pair of tickets will be given out by the Mavs as they judge who has the best painted face. We'll be back in just a moment. To give away 10 pairs of playoff tickets for tomorrow night's game to their favorite face painted fans. You still have a time to come on down for a chance to win. And man, they're looking pretty good out there this morning, Ron. Some oh, stiff, even a puppy. Some stiff competition, though. You better paint it up and get on down here. We're back in just a moment. Tickets, they are gathered outside here at Victory Park with faces painted and they are hoping to win 10 <laughs> pairs of playoff tickets. They are the only tickets in town. The Mavs decided to put out the call for people to come down here so they can give those tickets away. So don't miss your chance coming and, up. And Greg, one of the fans, as you showed us, even has the seven day forecast out there. There's with a couple us. of signs out there. We'll try to get another one up here uh, before the uh, hour is over. But a tons of rowdy Mavericks fans are here to score some playoff tickets. The Mavs are giving them away this morning. Ten pairs. We'll be right back on this Monday morning. Tons of wild Mavericks fans join us live at Victory Plaza hoping to win playoff tickets. Compliments of the Dallas Mavericks. Over to you outside. Alexa, I'm here with Joseph, who um, I think he might love more than the Mavs, uh, you. <laughs> oh, Alexa Konomos. Every morning, I just pray there's traffic so I can see her on the news. <laughs> That's... He went... Yes, Alexa! Oh, it's so good to see you. It's, it's good to know you're a good Christian boy. <laughs> I think you would be happy if you just read the phone book. Just read the all read phone book. All right, settle down or you'll never get a date. With her or anyone. Uh, I'm here with Roe Parrish, who uh, is joining us from the Mavs, and he has the unenviable task of trying to figure out who among this amazing crowd of fans will get 10 pairs of playoff tickets. And I understand you've you've already made one choice. How yes, difficult we, was it? We Well, it wasn't too difficult because we have the excellent chef here who has an excellent recipe for playoff success. So go ahead and tell them what we're going to do to get the win. Well, we need to get a little haywood going, fuel it with a little terry. Right. A little spark, a little... Uh, a little dash Rican, of kid. A little Puerto Rican spice and a whole lot of dirt. A little <laughs> bit of Rick. But we got this. We're going all the way. Championship. Yeah. Where, where are you from? From Dallas, Texas. And, and what's your name, sir? Izzy. Your name is? Izzy. Your name is Izzy? Yes. Izzy, Izzy. Yeah, they told me yesterday, hey, Izzy's going to be there tomorrow. Were they talking about you? Yeah, they were talking about me. <laughs> yeah. All right, thank you, Izzy. Much appreciated. Ooh. Izzy, uh, Izzy, I'm confused. Back to you. <laughs> My long-lost brother, okay. I'm being as honest as I can be. It could not have worked out any better. We checked the airfare to Memphis. We, we couldn't afford it. I had no desire to fly there. And driving to Oklahoma City, uh, I don't know that I can make the entire drive, uh, you know, straight through. I might have to stop, say, once I cross the border into Oklahoma City. Uh, I am as excited about this series as I've been about anything in a long time. Well, it is safe to say this is the hottest, hottest ticket in town. We are live outside Victory Park Studios now with a bunch of Mavs fans who showed up. Tickets are sold out. You can buy them on those resale websites, but you could pay a premium up to double. Some of our checks found out that they're up to double the face value. And now to the moment we've all been waiting for this morning. Of course, the Dallas Mavericks representatives are here. Come on in, reps, because Here's they Parrish. are going to give away 10 pairs yes. of Mavs tickets for tomorrow night's game, correct? Indeed we are. And we've had a selection process out here for the pandemic fans some very very creative skits out here and uh, here are some of the winners that are right here oh, who do we have here let's, let's run down 
What's your name? Uh, Jordan Rawls. And where are you coming from, Jordan? At Dallas, like a block away. Oh, just a block away. <laughs> People are coming two hours from Keller and you're a block away. Well, we were up all night making these costumes. I think we started at 9 o'clock. Oh, good for you. you I'm excited? Natalie, yeah. Have you ever really been to a Mavs game before? I have, I have. I love my Mavs. And Natalie, where are you from? Dallas. You also yeah. a block away? Yes, yes. <laughs> all right. We'll have to have a block party if you're just a block away. Yeah. How about for a championship? That I wasn't sure what it would take for everyone to get up at this hour, but I think we found out. <laughs> are you excited? I'm excited. I'm super excited. Woo! Yes. Mavs. Do you think this is going to change Mav fanfare moving forward, that more people might jump on the bandwagon? I think we'll see a lot more jumping, a lot more bandwagon, kind of like when the Rangers came in. But we're excited. The true fans are here today. Yeah! put out the call did you expect this you know what you I, did didn't you I, I did but yeah. this is way overwhelming this is way more than I expected and I'm glad to see all my Mavs fans out here all right so how many tickets have you given away how many do we have left let's bring everybody who's won down can we so, do that so, so this is what we're gonna do we're gonna announce it specially because because we have some special groups that won so this is what we're gonna do let me see the Germans come down come down come on down we like to do this before the game. We have a very special selection process, as I mentioned, and these guys have a very, as you see, he has the $5 bill like Deshaun Stevenson's tattoo. I like it. So let's see, our other winners, let's see, the Drizzle. Drizzle, come, on come up, down. Come on up, Drizzle. Come on up, come on up. We're on TV, we're on live TV. Come on down. We have the Drizzle, and you see he has nice golden locks just like Dirk. And the lady with her head in the basket. So, of course, these are our winners right now. We have some others, but do remember, if you do not win today, you can come out tomorrow before the game at the AAC, and we will be giving away much more playoff tickets, so you will have a chance to get in the building. I gotta get that mic back, or I'm gonna lose okay, a job. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, I gotta this, ask you This something. just became the Roe Paris show, ladies and gentlemen. I wanna ask you a question. Yes, ma'am. Let's do this again. Can we do this again? Absolutely. Okay, you heard it. So if you missed your chance to come out here today, and for all of you who did not win tickets, we're gonna try this again. Date to be determined. Yeah, not, not to put you on the spot on live TV or anything. Mm, <laughs> no. Oh, you'll do this again, right, Roe? Of course we will. That's what we do, Mavs. All we do is win. Come on in, guys. Oh, yeah.